pressure, pressure. I mean, I never in my life thought about pressure in basketball until I came to Memphis. Like, that's the one word that people in Memphis love to talk about, pressure. That's right, Mr. Joe Jackson. Welcome to the pressure cooker. And the question that many fans want to know, will the Tigers live up to great expectations? Good evening, everyone. Thanks for being with us. I'm Merle Purvis. Greg Coy has the night off. Okay, so tip-off is in less than an hour, and fans all over are ready to see their hometown boys take on the George Washington Colonials. Last time Tigers won the court, they lost pretty badly conference foes UConn. But the past is the past. We're ready for now. Fox 13's Matt Stark is in Raleigh. He has more on how the team is gearing up for their biggest game of the year. Well, it's game day for the Memphis Tigers, the eighth seed in the East region, as they get ready to take on ninth seeded George Washington here at the PNC Arena in Raleigh, North Carolina. Tip time is scheduled for about 5.55 Central Time. Now, the big key for tonight's game, who will be able to impose their will on the other? Memphis obviously wants to push the pace. They want to use their athleticism and their depth to their advantage. George Washington doesn't want that. They're not very deep. They only play about six players. However, they want to use their size in their inside game to their advantage. Again, whichever team is able to impose their will will likely come out of this game with a win. We're going to have to make shots. We're going to have to make shots. We're going to get some open looks at time. We're going to make threes. And it comes down to defending the three and making the three. We're trying to really worry about our shot selection and not turning the ball over. And if we can do that and get them to have to walk the ball up the court, that's our best chance. We just got to play our game. Um, it's, I don't think it's, it's, a, it's a thing about pace or anything like that. We just got to play our game, just, you know, both sides of the floor. It should be an exciting game. Again, tip time coming up tonight at 5.55 Central Time. I'll have highlights and reaction from the Tiger locker room coming up tonight during the Fox 13 News at 9 and 10. At the PNC Arena in Raleigh, North Carolina with the Tigers. Matt Stark, Fox 13 Sports. Okay, so those of uh, Monday morning uh, quarterbacks here, we say if they got six men, just wear them out at the very top. For the Tiger fans who could not make the trip to North Carolina, there are plenty of official watch parties all over Memphis. Fox 13's Lauren Lee is at one of those venues. She's out in East Memphis. Where are you, Lauren, at Brookhaven? We are at the Brookhaven, Merle, and you know, this is a big after work happy hour spot as it is. But when you have Tennessee game earlier, Memphis game coming up, there is quite a crowd. Now, all the people here, they've been sitting in these seats. They wanted to get a front row in front of the TV. But if you ask them, they will tell you they stayed at work until 5 o'clock and got to the Brookhaven just in time to watch the game. But no, there's a lot of people playing hooky out here today. Uh, they were able to get their seats ready to cheer on the Tigers. A good mix of Tennessee and Memphis fans out here. Tennessee fans are rolling out as the Memphis fans roll in and Memphis fans are excited but they're also a little bit uh, weary because of what happened in the big game against UConn in the AAC tournament. I think it's going to be a really tight game today. Uh, after what happened with UConn, a little down, but, you know, we'll rebound. We'll do well today. Hopefully we'll beat GW and then go on to play Virginia. It should be a walk in the park for us today. I mean, I uh, hope. Uh, we'll see what happens. I don't know. We hope we, hope we win anyways. I have confidence. I think they can make it in the first round. I'm not so sure about the next game. To be honest, my bracket doesn't have them, but I'm still going to pull for them because they are my alma mater. Go Tigers! <laughs> All right, so out at the Brookhaven here, they've got a lot going on. And for all card-carrying Memphis alumni members, there are discounts at any of the official watch parties. If you want to find out where one of those watch parties are, they're all over Shelby County and Memphis. We have the full list on our website, myfoxmemphis.com, and our My Fox Memphis Facebook page. So go there to find out where you can watch the game. Reporting live in East Memphis, Lauren Lee, Fox 13 News.